All right, here is the standard startup for the 4x4 fiber laser. Begin with plugging in the two outlets. This is the blower, and this is the laser. Be sure to plug it in to the outlet with the buck booster, not the other one. Plug it in, turn on the breaker, make sure the light it comes on for the surge protector. Now walk behind the unit, check the fluid level on the cooler, open the gas nozzle, several turns, open this up, check your oil level, I'm still okay, look around underneath for any large puddles of either water or oil. If there are any, uh, don't turn it on, figure out what's going on. Uh, first off, we flip this switch. You should hear that turn on, lights all start blinking and it starts doing its thing. The computer automatically turns on when it has power. While it's coming up, go ahead and turn our remote control on. Turn our keyboard on, turn the mouse on. And while it's turning on, you can also turn the electric lock to on. That's going to turn the uh, follow control thing gizmo on. And then go ahead and enable the servos. Now that the computer is up, open side cut. This is version 6.3. As soon as it opens, it should give you a window that is requesting, I always just hit the top one. The um, One thing I did kind of forget to mention is always look inside the machine before you hit that button. Make sure there's nothing obstructing the gantry. Um, because this is an automated thing, it's just going to move across. Make sure all the doors are shut. All right, that's it. The machine is now homed, and we can go ahead and get the gantry out of our way and start loading material. Always check all the doors um, that they're closed before starting to cut. That's it.